Hey, buddy, do you know what's happening? Do you want to go to the dog festival? Yeah? All right, let's go. Let's go to the dog festival. Yay. Do what you want to. Please don't be polite, because I like your attitude. Let's forget about a curfew. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. So much fun. So much fun. Yeah. You ready to come? Let's go to the dog festival. You ready for the dog festival? All right, let's go. dog festival is over it's time to sing some sasa uh, for another few hours so I have rehearsal right after this so it was a busy day for sure last night it was really good I feel good about the little small group participation that I was asked to do um, and uh, I feel like I can do this and I was just really tired it was just so much pressure this weekend I had um, a recording that I made with a pianist that I've worked with a few times for auditions um, so I need to edit that recording I haven't even listened to it because I'm because I feel stressed out listening to it because of, you know, I don't really like to listen to recordings of my own singing, so it's going to be tough, but 
it's fine. It's Monday. We're going to start the week strong. I got things to do, but we're going to go ahead and get those done. I've got videos to edit and I've got bed linens and bed sheets to wash and a dog to exercise. So we're going to get the stuff in the wash. And then we're going to take Clover for a little walk. Maybe we'll go um, somewhere interesting today. Go around. Uh, uh, go around. I think he's done. <laughs> There's no shade in here. That's the shade. It's real sad. Look at him. He's totally done. Oh, here he comes. He's just taking a break. Were you just taking a break? Huh? You good? You ready to go? Yeah? Oh, you can hardly get that out. Yeah? Okay, can you be quiet, please? Quiet. Thank you. Nice. Wow, he's still going. It's been like a half hour now. When he's a puppy, I would come out here and do this for like an hour and a half. I ain't got that kind of time anymore. <laughs> <laughs> a half hour seems to be, you know, pretty good for him. It gets him nice and tired. But um, he could probably go for, he could probably go for longer. Oops. Oh, that was a bad throw. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, that's my fault. My fault. All right, sorry. Let's try again. Here we go. There it is. That's better. That's better. Yeah. I mean, I wish that I was this amused by, like, just chasing the ball and bringing it back. I mean, he thinks it's the best thing in the world, right? Is this your, this is your, this is your drugs? This is your drug, doggy drugs? All right, all right, here we go. Ready? Okay, so it's one o'clock, and I have not done nearly a, enough that I've wanted to do today, but I've um, almost finished doing the laundry with the bedroom, and I have had a huge disgusting lunch, which I won't talk about. I mean, it wasn't disgusting. It was really delicious, but like, it was really unhealthy. Um, I just had a craving nachos, I had to do it. Um, but I've been to Target, we've been to the park, we've been taking care of all of the plants. There was massive watering going on this morning. Everyone is doing absolutely lovely, especially my beautiful Calathea Makoyana that I got for $12 at Home Depot. So excited about her. She just looks perfect. She just, she doesn't get me any trouble. I mean, yet. We'll see if I can keep her free of brown tips. Um, the Orbifolia is not doing that great. I, she's really, really, really fussy. Like, what's this? Like, I just, it's really tough. So I got some, I was giving it filtered water, but I think it needs distilled water because I keep getting these brown tips. It's, the humidity is high enough. So I got some distilled water from Target. So, uh, you, 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 you is picky. The rest of the, the babies are doing great. Oh, an update. So I ordered two of these. Um, well, I ordered the whole set of these vases or I guess pots from Anthropology. They're like a collaboration with Anthropology and a uh, Croatian artist. Uh, I can't remember the name, but I'll put it up on the screen. And I ordered a third one, which completed the set, but it came to me broken. And I was really upset, but my husband noticed that it popped back up on anthropology.com and he bought it for me. And now I have a complete set again. How cute is that? Is that not adorable? My Maranta is completely covering the face, but at night it it shoots up its leaves, but I am really excited to have a full set of these cute, adorable pots. This buddy's tired from the park, so he's probably gonna have a nice, good nap. Look at how angry he looks. Oh, I'm sorry. Jeez. And I think I've told some of you guys on um, Instagram, I've done a little hinting on videos in the past, and I will just say officially, oh, here comes, here comes Clover. You just had to come over here? Okay. I will officially tell you guys that, um, yes, it's true, the rumors are true. Well, they're not rumors, but uh, yes, we are moving out of this uh, amazing apartment. I love this apartment and I have. It's my first place that I've ever owned. Um, and it was a great investment. However, uh, we are in need of some extra space um, because we only have um, one bathroom, as you have seen from my videos, and we have one bedroom 
and uh, I don't have an office. So um, I'd like to talk to you guys a little bit about that too. So I don't know if you've noticed, but well, I, how could you notice? I've had my channel for three years now and I find that myself making videos more and more and going to see clients in person less and less. So my 70% of my business is now this YouTube channel. So I work from home a lot of the time and uh, I need a place to work that's not like my general living area. It's just, it, it makes me feel kind of weird like working and living in the same area that has, it just has one purpose. So um, I, those of you who have seen my channel before know that I work at the couch or sometimes I even work at the kitchen counter there and it's just, it feels not awesome. So um, I needed a place where I could have an office. My husband also works from home occasionally as well, uh, but not as much as me. So we needed a place where we could work and have guests over and stay, which we have not been able to. We've had someone sleep on the couch a couple of times, but that's not really like ideal, right? So um, we have purchased a two bedroom, two bathroom condo, a new construction. So we are definitely moving uh, in the next uh, couple of months. So that is happening and I intend to completely like fill you guys in on the move and give you guys some moving tips because I have moved a lot. I am a military brat. I am an expert mover and packer. So I will be giving you some tips on how to have an organized move, but um, moving is stressful for anyone, no matter how many times they've done it. It's a life change and it's just very stressful, but I'm very excited. Oh, we're gonna have some outdoor space. I'm so excited. So it's my first time I've had a porch, yay. Oh, also in saying that, that YouTube is now sort of my um, mostly full-time job. I mean, I do still do a lot of singing gigs and um, organizing in person, but this has become um, a really great source of uh, work for me. So I will give you a warning that there will be some product placements um, sprinkled in uh, over the next few months. Um, I, I promise it won't be every video, but I just wanted to give you a warning. I am very transparent about what is uh, sponsored content and or what's like PR samples that were sent to me. I only want to work with brands who I think will benefit you as a viewer. Um, and I get emails in my box all the time, you know, wanting me to review like shampoo and rice cookers and air fryers and um, random things that I don't think that will be important to you guys. So um, I only work selectively with brands. So I want to make sure that you guys know that uh, it's not just, I'm not just taking everything that's offered to me that I'm very, I'm being very choosy. Um, and you are welcome to skip these product placements if you'd like. Um, I will be very upfront for how long they go and you can do what you want. But I just wanted to give you a warning in advance. Um, but I think that I actually think that you'll be pleased with some of the stuff that's being reviewed and that I'm trying. So uh, please look forward to that. But I will definitely be doing, uh, a, you know, the new home reveal, all that stuff in the next, you know, few months. It probably won't be closer to Christmas uh, just because things take a while to get settled. So um, I guess look forward to that. That's so that's a little bit of a life update. But in the meantime, the house is like kind of crazy. I still trying to keep it clean, but we've got a lot of furniture arriving for our new place and stuff I'm buying for our new place when I'm seeing it like I saw a trash can at Marshall's the other day that I was looking for anyway and it was only for like for $13 and I grabbed it and I'm like well and now I have to like have this trash can hang out in my apartment in that I don't have room for so there's like stuff there's stuff everywhere this corner is absolutely ridiculous I ordered this is a side table um, or an accent table I ordered from anthropology I haven't opened it yet uh, but I ordered it because it was on sale and this is uh, like wallpaper <laughs> and oh that's something I have to give away and um, oh you guys are gonna see um, how I used my exact mats <laughs> hopefully I think the video will go out before this video but um they uh, were really nice to work with and um, I've been talking with them for like actually for a while to feature this product and I think you'll really like it. I really want to use this in my new house so I'm excited to show you guys what exact mats can do. Not sponsored. I've also got craziness going on in my closet. Like I have no room for all this stuff. I've got this, this Marshall's bag is so cute you guys. 99 cents. I'm sorry like off topic though. They don't have a clover. I mean the closest we can get is Cocker Spaniel but I mean come on. Anyway. <laughs> I got a trash can for the new house since I already have this can in white. I figured I'd get it in gold too and not, I would just buy the same bags. Like that makes sense, right? And only $13. And then I got a new mat for Clover's new eating area in the new house. And I've got some um, OXO 
pop canisters. Um, this uh, is something for a video uh, in a few weeks, so keep a lookout for that. But get excited. My husband and I, we are, we are, we were kind of stressed out by the whole like buying and selling like new apartment thing, um, but now that it's sort of getting closer to the time we have to move, we're getting really excited. My husband has been hoarding boxes, well not hoarding, but like gathering boxes off Craigslist, like free boxes. I've also been um, hoarding packing material that has been sent to me. <laughs> Sometimes when people send products to me, or if I order something, I'll just take the packing material and save it for the move. So it's under the bed right now. So that's fun. I'm gathering like, I'm just hoarding things under the bed. But um, anywhere I can save a penny, uh, on moving materials is important to me because moving materials are super expensive and you only use them once and never ever again just throw them out it's ridiculous so if I can save a ton of money on moving materials I will in the past um, especially since I was a container store employee I would just like buy tons of boxes from TCS and like have a ball but like I'm not doing that this time um, I am going to be trying to save all the money I can because I need money to decorate the new apartment <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, I need money to uh, outfit all the closets with Alpha. I have them all designed, but I just haven't purchased them yet because I'm waiting for another sale. I know there's a sale going on right now and I'm waiting for another sale. We just need to save money to decorate the apartment because I, I just want the apartment to look awesome. And I'm getting my own personal office, which is amazing so that I can work and practice in a room and close the door in peace and not be disturbed by everybody and their mother when I need to like learn a whole opera in two days. <laughs> so um, I am excited for the fall. Um, I'm not excited for the fall weather, but I'm excited for like fall uh, events. Um, I do love fall in Boston and I will be, I do, um, I do have a video planned that features Clover in Boston in the fall, which, um, which should be very cute and extremely heartwarming. Um, look out for that because I, Boston in, the autumn is something very magical. Yes, oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. We're drinking pumpkin spice, where the leaves are so pretty. And then like in winter time, everyone complains. Uh, like, it, well, people don't start complaining really until January. Um, and then at January through March, everyone's just complaining about the snow and the cold and the dirty snow and the weather and it's horrible. And then when it gets warm, we forget about it and are all happy again. But I just wanted to give you guys a quick life update. I probably talked too much in this vlog, but I'm gonna edit this for you guys. Get it up for you this weekend. And um, I hope you're having a great morning, great evening, great afternoon. I don't know why I say this out of order. It's fine, wherever you are. And <laughs> I'll see you in the next one.